What is going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Um, today I really just wanted to first of all say thank you so much for the, all the support on the top three Hunger Games video. And that is mostly why I'm doing this video. I noticed a lot of you guys were having trouble getting into, I'm um, assuming MCSG, you guys didn't really specify uh, what server was having the issue, but I'm assuming it's MCSG considering I had issues as well. And uh, so first I'm just going to kind of rattle off a bunch of stupid shit it might be and then go into um, in depth more of the more difficult technical side. So the first step is admitting that we have a problem, guys. We have a Oh my god. All right, the jokes. All right, I'm done with jokes. It's tutorial time. I just want to dive right into this. I don't want to be that faggot. So all right. Number 1, make sure it's an account you bought. Make sure you didn't torrent it or something like that. If it if it's a torrented account, then that may very well be the issue. So make sure you bought the account. Um Secondly, just restart your computer. Just try that. If it doesn't work, then just continue following these steps. But just do that first. Um, and then the last dumb thing it might be is make sure uh, all your mind, you don't have multiple Minecrafts open, and that's even on a laptop and a computer. So just make sure you're in one Minecraft. Now, if you're still having these issues, um, by the way, the issues I saw were bad login and um, can't resolve host name. The issue I had was can't resolve host name and bad login, I think. So if you're getting a bad login, what you're going to want to do is you want to go in your Minecraft launcher, do not log in, go to options right here, and then click this force update button. And then once, once you do that, you actually should be fine. Um, that should resolve that issue for you. Um, now, if you are getting can't resolve host name, it's a little more complicated. What you're going to want to do is go to your browser, <coughs> excuse me, and uh, you're going to want to put this website in there. It's store.opendns.com slash setup. So you're going to want to go to that. And I uh, got my really crappy internet. Um, and then what you're going to want to go to now is um, obviously change your DNS on your computer, on your pooter. And in here it will give you a variety of things you can do for your Windows, Mac, and all that fun stuff, even mobile devices. So that's pretty cool. So what you're going to want to do, uh, this just shows you how to do it. So I'm just going to do Windows 7. I'm not going to do it on my computer because it walks you through everything. But um, I know most people have Windows 7. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to kind of read it off for you guys. And then um, so you can do it while I'm talking, I guess. And you can just kind of minimize YouTube for the time being. So what you're going to want to do is go to your control panel in the start menu. Um, once you're there, you're going to want to open up your network and sharing center. And then after that, you want to go to your connection, whatever that may be, whether it's a local area connection or wireless. Um, so you're going to want to click that connection that you see. And then um, it'll give you a little general tab that you'll be in. And then you're, in the bottom left, there will be properties. So open that. After you open that properties, um, you should see a bunch of checked boxes with a bunch of crazy shit in it. And uh, you're going to want to go to the fifth one down, which is, er, it may not be the fifth one, but inter Internet Protocol Version 4. Make sure it's version 4 or uh, TCP IP IPv4. So make sure you're in that one. Just highlight it, and then you're going to click Properties. You don't need to uncheck anything. Just make sure you have that highlighted and then go into Properties. So then next, and these DNS uh, numbers are actually correct. What you're going to want to do is you're going to want to Ch it, I guarantee you probably have obtained DNS server address automatically. You're going to want to check the use the following DNS addresses, and then you're going to want to enter 208-67-222-222 for the first one, for the preferred. And then for the alternate DNS server, you're going to want to type in 208-67-220-220. So once you guys have that, just hit OK and then exit out of all the boxes or just OK out of all the boxes. And then, honestly, that should solve your problem. If you guys are still having issues, let me know. I'll do some research, figure out what's going on with your Minecraft. Because um, these are really great servers that I want you guys to play on. It, they're the best of the best. Um, and uh, make sure, uh, if you enjoyed this video, uh, leave a like, uh, sub, and all that fun stuff. I got a new top five um, Hunger Games moments of the week coming. So, uh, or actually, I already have an episode out. It'll be one every week. And you guys submit your videos. Um, and kind of go over them, just like a top five Call of Duty plays. So that's pretty cool. So if you are if you enjoyed the top three, then go check that out. But other than that, guys, I hope this helped. I really do. Um, and again, thanks for all the support on the vid. And I'm Cash, and I'm out.